Hello everybody, welcome back to more Spyro 2, this is Arcarona, welcome you back to Spyro 2, blah blah blah. Last time we completed both the Metro and Arctic Speedways, and in this episode we are playing Magma Cone, so let's go. I'm playing Magma Cone, we're doing Magma Cone, we're doing it. Oh yeah, I've got to replay the intro, sorry guys. All oh, those fawns. So here we are in Magma Cone. Well, let's talk to this fawn. Hello, Spyro. I suppose you're here for the party. I'm afraid it's been cancelled because the stupid Earth Shaper set off the volcano. Really? Really? So what we got to do is help out with these fawns, ladders, and lasses, whatever they be. I'm sorry, I won't make fun of the Scottish accent. I can't really because, you know, being part Scottish myself. <laughs> By the way, if you didn't want to learn climb or are able to do the double jump, you can do the double jump from here to avoid doing the climb. So this is Magma Cone. And the gimmick of Magma Cone is to defeat these Earth Shapers. We haven't met the Earth Shapers yet, this is actually like the second time we're supposed to have met them, but bleh, you know, screw it. Now, Magma Cone in my eyes is one of the more fun levels in this game. Well, fun, fun until one thing, but I'll talk about that in a second. Yeah, the design of this area is really cool. Plus, it's got one of my favourite themes in all Spyro 2. Ow! You. No. Twerp arm. Concussion! So, the enemies in this level are Earth Shapers, which are these guys. Ow, you got me still. Oh well. Fodder is snails, which make the word sound. Ah! Ow! Stone away! These fawns are mean, I don't care if the Earth Shakers have ruined their chance for the party, they're, they're, they're mean, you don't throw rocks at people, guys. <laughs> so yeah, there's not really much you can say about this level apart from it's a lava filled doom land, pretty much. I know. Will this be the second time I die in the project? Probably. Well, unfortunately, the emulator keeps like resetting the music, so we won't be able to ever hear the um, awesomeness of the Magma Cone level theme. Tell you what, I'll put I'll put a preview. I'll put the theme at the end of the level for you guys if you so want. If you want to hear it, it's going to be at the end of the episode because I just love this theme so much. So yeah, there's not really much you can talk about the war. So what do you guys, so how are you guys... I hope I'm keeping you guys entertained with Klonoa and... No one enjoying it. Sorry about the lack of out outro and Klonoa, it's just like... Well, if it's a blind LP, I'm not really going to be saying much, am I, so... Ah, I fell. <laughs> Whereas in Spyro, I can say a lot more. It's like, I know more about Spyro too. They haven't completed it. 100% like 3, 4, 5, maybe 6 times. <laughs> okay, now we've got another Earth Shaper here now. Just push them onto the X and the Fawn will kill them in some way. Which is nice. But before we do that, there's something else you, I want to do quickly. Zap. It's going up here. Now there's a hold here. What's down here? Well, it's possibly the worst mission in the whole game. 
any Spyro 2 fan or any Spyro fan or any classic Spyro fan or any Hunter hate all know that this is the worst mission in the game. So I have only one thing to say. Anyway, so let's go. Hey Spyro, check out this cool cave I found. <laughs> let's play a little game. That one Every I... so often, a piece of this crystal popcorn pops out of the ground. The first one to grab ten of them. Crystal popcorn. Crystal popcorn. I'm ready when you. Name of the game is to just grab ten crystal popcorn. I grabbed that game. The only thing I can say is when you're following the steam things to try and grab the crystal popcorn, just stand up by the hole and you'll be able to grab it. Okay, you win. Here's an or Okay, so that was the easy part. So now comes the hard I'll part. I'll give you another orb if you can beat me again. Let's play to 15 this time. What do you say? Fine. I'm ready. Let's go. We're playing to 15 now. Now Hunter's going to be a little bit faster this time, and his AI is going to be really on third. So he's already got three. I missed it. And he never misses them, as opposed to the fact that you can miss them. No, I missed that one, I can't get it. Get that one. And this one. Stolen! Done it. You're really good. Okay, we did that in one go, people. Not a bad episode, if I must say. But that's not the only bad mission in this whole level. But with that, we've beaten Hunter's stupid challenge. Let's go up here. Be -de -boo. Do -do -do. Stupid emulator. Just resets the song all the time so we won't be able to enjoy it properly. Yeah, I'll put it in the end of the episode, why not? Evil thorns. They're evil. I don't know. He's got a hammer. Now this one is just mean. I can't I can't condemn this. That's just brutal. Right, so anyway. I'm going up here. There he is, people. Money bags again. And there are four lives here, so yeah. Awesome. Well, if it Asking for 200 gems to pay for an elevator, but you can avoid paying for him here. Which I'm gonna do. So just go over here. By the way, if you can hear my um, pad, that's because I'm using my laptop mic as opposed to my headset mic, because I'm a complete idiot, I left it at uh, friends. But you know, why do I take my headset mic with me? I don't know, because I don't record when I'm away, so. Yeah, we're not getting the actual chance to hear being properly here, are we? Because I'm just running it out. Right, 
that. Double jump up there. I'm sure you set up. Oh, never mind. Double jump. Right now, by gliding from here, we're at. You were inside the volcano. We don't need to pay money bags. Now this is where the elevator would have brought us. So yeah. I can't remember if I need to go up this way. Although I'm a big fan of Magma Cone, I can't really remember the level layout that too well because I'll just speed run it all the time. Okay, we've just got to go up and dodge these boulders. Climb all the way up. And close the top of this volcano. Thanks for closing the lid on the volcano, Spyro. Things were getting a little too hot around here. By the way, here's a talisman I was saving for the party later. I think you deserve it more. And with, and with that, we receive the Magma Corn Talisman. I'm sorry. But so anyway, we're now going to be doing a mission. Oh, hello. Hey Spyro, you're just in time for the party. Well, you would be if those nasty lava monsters hadn't stolen our hats. It just won't be the same without party hats. Indeed it won't, so let's go get it. So that spawns these lava monster things. And the goal is just quite simply shoot them down. But you can't flame them and you can't charge them. So by grabbing hold of this, shoot. Basically, it's just grabbing a hold of these lava stones and just shooting the guys down. But don't un don't underestimate these guys. They have any ridiculous range on their attack. But then again, so does Spyro. So, so we've got twelve of these guys, but don't worry, when you run out of Superfly, the challenge doesn't reset or something ridiculous like that. It's just simply hitting all twelve of them. Be sure to hit those balloons on the way around as well, because you know, gems. Okay, so there's some in here. I'm doing surprisingly well, I'm normally pretty bad at this one. actually hitting these guys pretty effectively. We've got what, four left? Awesome. Oh, there's one there. Again, sorry if there's not much talking. I mean, what else can I say? I'm flying around shooting lava creatures. It's not really... Ow, you got me. These are probably the only enemies in the game that can hit me for two. That can get you for two hits. Oh, with 100% no spy. I got 100% of the. I nearly said rings. Why the hell was I about to say rings? This isn't something a bloody hedgehog. Also, you don't have to worry about climbing all the way back up to the top. Climbing all the way back up the ladder on the volcano, just use this wall and go up. There you are. Shoot. One left. He's down here. Whoa. Got him. Thanks, Spyro. You saved the party. Here, this got mixed in with the cheese balls, and I almost chipped a tooth on it. <laughs> really? Awesome stuff. There we go. Bim, bim, bim. Do, 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 do. There we go. 100 percent of Magma Cone. And with that, was the exit of the level? What's up there? Right, so with that, we've completed Magma Cone. So see you guys back in the home world. Well, I'm going to be going back in the home world anyway. Yep, those fawns are evil, they kill each other. Hey, now that we've done that, 
Nou, u van je bezin, het maak maar gewoon. Nu is gewoon naar een leuke episode. Do plop. What episode I'm doing in the next level? No, what level I'm doing in the next episode? <laughs> Double jump up the stairs. How many episodes have I done this? In doing. I'm not sure. I know what episode I'm doing next. I know what level I'm doing next episode. Apply the dragon handbrake. Next level we're doing is Breeze Harbor. So with that. For God's sake. In this episode, we've 100 percent at Magma Cone and did pretty well, I'd say. I mean, getting through Hunter's pop, uh, Crystal Popcorn Challenge in one go is pretty good, I must say. For myself. If I do say so myself. And with that, guys, I'll see you next episode of Spyro 2, where we're tackling the awesomeness that is Breeze Harbor. So, with that. Bye bye!